Hello and welcome to um, this week's Sunday show and um, so we have a wonderful guest um, and he's been coming through um, most times at the moment and that's God and so he is going to be doing the speaking but before we go to God I would just like to remind everyone don't forget to subscribe so that you can always be notified um, of when a new video or when God is speaking and um, if you're watching on Instagram don't forget to follow as well so anyway without further ado let's go and see what what God has to say he is saying that he um, enjoys very much um, being able to have this opportunity to talk to you and he says that if he didn't have this opportunity he would be looking for other ways to explore how to communicate with with the human race because he has reached a point where he realizes that there has to be some changes and these changes has to start with himself which is where he wishes to be in not only just in the hearts of people but and the minds of people but he wants to be present present in your lives so that you are aware of him and feel him and know him and and know everything about him he wants to have a complete transparency about everything that he does and he is saying that um, in order for him to be um, this person in your life, in order for, to have this transparency, he sees this as, as something, as a challenging task because um, it takes time for people to accept that he is real, um, except that he is really talking and except that that there is a possibility that that he um, really does exist and that he really is available for you. So he feels he realizes that there is certainly a hurdle uh, 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 that he has to leap across um, and, and, and this is where he's do it, placing all the work um, at the moment. He's not only working through Gail, but he's working through other people where he is giving his voice to people. And soon you will start to see that, that it will be so commonplace that, that where he is talking to other people and it is not an, an unusual occurrence. He feels that once people have established in the minds of themselves that it is indeed true and it is indeed possible that he can communicate with us. Um, and he sort of got a little smile on his face and he's saying, um, who would have thought that I can make the world and the heavens and the, and 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 do all what all the creation that I've done? Um, who would have thought that I couldn't talk to to a human being? Um, and he's he's sort of chuckling to that and he's saying to me that um, he he um, he realizes, of course, that that this is going to take some time for people to understand his authenticity with Gail. He says that also that um, once people have established in their minds that, 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 that there is a clarity of thought in that they believe that he is true and exists, he wants um, to take um, the human race to a new understanding of, 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 his, of what he can do for, for humans. And all of this is going to be done through Gail um, because he feels that Gail is um, he is the one that he has chosen to to give his words and to to give these words to humanity and and he wants people to um, understand his choice um, furthermore he says that um, he wishes also to establish um, a place in everyone's heart. He wants people to realize that he is there for not just a select few or the person that he is speaking to. He is there for every single person that exists. And he says that 
for some people, the only way that you can communicate with, with him, because you do not yet have the skills that Gail has, is that you can pray. And he says what happens when somebody prays is that the pray prayers automatically come to my world. And we have a, a system where we are able to access these prayers and distribute the prayers amongst us all. And some will go to me and some will go to Jesus and some will go to Mo Mother Mary and some will go to, you know, saints or whoever he chooses or, or, the, or they choose to take on the task. Um, but he can assure you that prayers are always looked at and considered. Prayers are not ignored and he wants that, that to really get across because he feels that's, that's really important that people understand this. Um, the other thing that he wants to say is that um, it's not just prayers, that um, he wants to talk about, and he's raising my hands, he wants to talk about, and he's calling them these healing hands, and he says that I personally have chosen Gail to do my healing through, and so I will use these hands to do all the healing that is necessary, and in time you will start to see that there is numerous um, amounts of healings that are going to be done, because I have have made a consideration about health and sickness in your world and for some people it is a lesson that they've chosen that they wish to have but for others it is not it is not their lesson it is not what they have chosen but due to perhaps a set of circumstances that they have embarked upon through their own free will they have found themselves in a situation where they are um, immersed in sickness. And he is saying that this immersion in sickness needs to be eradicated and one by one he will be picking out people where he can take away their sickness and take away their ill health. Um, and, and those, are, again, he wants to just um, make sure that people understand that the people that are going to receive this healing are the people that have not chosen ill health as part of their lives. Once this has been done and, and prayers have been answered, he has much optimism that people will understand and accept that he is true and he is here and he is believable and he is first and foremost in each person's life. And so he bows my head and draws my hands together and he says it is my greatest wish that as everybody listens to these videos that a spark of truth is ignited in the minds of many, that all people who listen to my words will understand that I have a work to do that is about healing the minds of people showing people that I am true, but also healing the sickness of people that exists. He urges people to, to send out their prayers and it is his wish to as answer as many as he possibly can. And he's thanking you for listening. And so I just want to say, um, first of all, I want to say thank you to God um, because I think um, he is really in this message, it's about him appealing to many to, sh to ask them to accept his authenticity and um, talking about his, his future plans. Um, so interesting words and, um, and, it, and it shows um, part of his character and, and what he wants. So thank you for listening and see you soon. Goodbye.